Chances are, if you have audio running in the background of your stream, you're going to want that audio looped, whether that's one file or multiple files in a playlist. And we're gonna show you now how to make sure that your audio is looped and doesn't just play once. So I'm going to add, or I already have added, a VLC video source here. Uh, let's get rid of that and we're gonna add a new one. We're gonna go plus on the sources menu and we're going to go to VLC video source. Now, you might be thinking, Ben, we need to add an audio source. Why are you adding a VLC video source? This name is actually quite misguiding. The VLC video source is great for adding audio sources as well. So we're gonna choose this as our audio source of choice, VLC video source. We're going to go, I'm gonna call this background, oh, got my caps lock on, <laughs> background music. And we're gonna leave that there. Now, it's gonna open up this menu. What I need to do, I need to first make sure that this button here, loop playlist, is clicked and engaged. And then in our playlist here, I need to add all of the audio files that I want to loop in a playlist. So I'm gonna go plus, I'm gonna go add files, and I'm gonna find the piece of music that I want to have on that playlist. You can select one. If there were 10 pieces of music in this list, I could select 10 and add them to the playlist. But for now, I'm just gonna add one. You can also shuffle the playlist if you want. So that will mix up the order every time that the playlist is looped. Obviously with one song, you can't shuffle anything. So I'm gonna keep that off. Um, keep all the other settings as they are. Press okay and we will now see in our mixer that it is playing our music. I'm going to, as we discussed before, I'm going to monitor this sound so you guys can hear it as well. I'm actually, first things first, I'm gonna turn it down because otherwise it's gonna be super loud. And advanced audio properties and monitor only. There we go, so now you guys can get a little jam of that. Now in theory, I've clicked the loop button. So when this finishes, you can see this little slider here. When this gets to the end, if we sit and wait patiently, In seven seconds, we should hear the same song. There we go. So having that loop playlist button checked, make sure that your audio loops. You can also do this with obviously videos and media sources. So we go media source here, we go okay. And as you add your media source, whether it's a video or audio, you can add audio this way as well. Just click loop and it will loop the file over and over again. And that's it. Pretty simple. Have ongoing, constant background music for your streams by making sure that that loop button is checked.